and I do agree it looks a bit more like a spaceship control pad than a steering wheel. <laughs> um, so to start off with, there's a few differential switches. Differential has a big influence on the balance of your car in cornering and it's split into different areas. So there's entry, mid corner and exit and also high speed. It's very, very important to get those spot on, those settings of the differential, especially for a qualifying lap. It can really have tenths of a second difference per lap. Um, then you go to the torque switch. Torque is it's your pedal map, so with how much pedal do you get how much power from the engine. And you can change the settings there. So for example, if it starts raining, you're going to change that to a softer pedal map so that you don't get so much power. And you have mixture here. That's told to you by the engineers. It's change how lean or how rich the engine is running with the fuel. Uh, bite point is the clutch. So uh, that's for clutch settings, which also the engineer will tell you for the start. This is the radio. Start the next lap. Four the tires now. Uh, here's the cursed boost button, so with the push of the button there you get a 10% uh, increase in engine power and a big boost. Um, and this is the cursed harvesting, so this dictates how much harvesting is actually happening, which you can reduce or increase with this uh, rotary here. And these grips are custom made so that we have good grip and so that it sits well in our hand. Speed limiter, when you come into the pits, you push the button and the car will not be able to go over 100 kph. Good thing. The, box. the gear shift RPM will come on these lights here. Here, there's also the light for the uh, for the rear wing. Uh, when that goes on, it tells you, okay, now you can use it. You're close enough to the guy in front. There's the rear wing button, which is located somewhere in the back here, because there wasn't enough space in the front, so we had to put some buttons in the back. Then on the back, which I'm not allowed to show, uh, there's the shift paddles and the clutch lever, and that's it. So now I have to go. This is Michael's wheel, and without the wheel, he's not going to be able to drive.